segment. Tonight's special guest is Derek Sieber, uh, Sieber. Uh, he is from CD Baby. Welcome. Thanks. First of all, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? About myself? Sure. All right, I'm a musician, first and foremost, that uh, was touring around the country, just making a full-time living as a musician ever since, uh, I don't know, the age of 18. I think I had a job once for a little while. But, uh, but other than that, I've just been a full-time musician for 10 years, touring colleges, uh, had some really good gigs as a guitarist, playing for some uh, Japanese pop stars and things like that that would fly me around the world and playing in front of, you know, 15,000 seats at the age of 21 and things like that. And uh, ended up taking my own band around the college circuit and really learning not, um, how to not just be somebody else's sideman, but how to really control your own uh, business or run a band like a business. Mm -hmm. And uh, my own band called Hit Me was doing so well uh, with our own CD that uh, we needed a place to sell it mm -hmm. online. And I was getting so much into the internet that uh, realized there was no good place online that would sell your CD. Mm -hmm. So I started this little thing, not meaning for it to be a business, called CD Baby, just to sell my CD, a couple dozen friends, and uh, it they, took off. It took off. You know, the couple dozen friends told a couple dozen friends, and kind of mushroomed. It mushroomed, <laughs> and now, uh, <laughs> now it's you know every waking moment. I'm working on the web. One of those kind of typical kind of dot com startup stories where nobody sleeps, and we all live off of diet coke and stuff like that. And uh, and so now you it. got 2,500 artists. Yeah, 2,500 artists on CD Baby. All of them, uh, like these guys, completely independent artists who have just released their own CD themselves. Uh -huh. Uh, have no record deal, just doing it th themselves. Some of them are kind of don't want a record deal. You know, if Warner Brothers calls, they you know say no thanks and hang up because they want to. Like uh, Ani DeFranco is the best example of somebody just that knows that it's, there's a good life to be had doing it yourself. Fantastic. So those are the people we deal with. Terrific. Now, what are your criteria as far as getting a band and and, and being on? Criteria. I mean, do you like screen anybody? Do you like to accept everybody? Yeah, we we accept everybody. The, yeah. Um, I had, when we first when I first started it, I thought uh, I thought about playing you know playing an A and R guy and deciding what was good and what isn't, and uh, but the only problem with that is whenever I really love a CD that comes into the store because we still listen to every single CD that we sell. Mm -hmm. Whenever I really love a CD, sure enough, you know I can't get anybody to buy it, and uh, the ones that didn't even catch my attention on the way in uh, become top sellers. So it's probably a good thing that I don't screen. Okay. So if there, you know, any musicians out there who have released their own CD and think that there's somebody out there who wants to buy it, we'll sell it for them. Okay. All right. It, now, is there a cost for this or anything like that? Tell me about ah, that. Ah, thirty-five bucks. It's uh, you know, we we still we do everything by hand. We we make a web page. Somebody sends in their CD. We'll say, we make a web page for them. You know, look at the color scheme on their album. Try to match it. Make a good web page. Uh, no advertising anywhere, and it takes about thirty minutes. So. Um, okay. Oh, CD you, baby, look at that. Yeah. Uh, 18 Juniper Lane, Woodstock, New York. Uh, the phone number is 1-800-448-6369. You can also email at info at cdbaby.com. And it's http backslash www.cdbaby.com. Yeah. Okay. yeah, the site itself, if anybody, uh, any music fans uh, watching this show, every single CD we sell out of those 2,000 plus, you can go listen to sound clips. You can listen to about half the CD online. Uh, it actually sounds pretty good. Uh, you can get more info about the band, click to their website, see where they're playing. So yeah, it's, it's an amazing way to just go through and check out new music. You know, we have it divided by category if you want that. There's also, uh, we have this uh, album art gallery, kind of like the old experience of just walking through the aisles of a record store, you know. Fantastic. Get to just look at the album art and go, oh, that looks cool, what is that? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah. Sounds very exciting. What's, uh, what's in store for you in the next five years? Tell me about that. Next five years? I should be doing my laundry a little more often. Um, <laughs> let's see, I should uh, sleep a little bit. Um, I'm going to start sleeping next year. That's my plan for next year. No, I don't know. Five years, I don't know. Um, it's five years, I hope that in five years we still have no advertising on the site, and I hope I'm still hanging up the phone on investors, and uh, I hope I'm still running it right out of Woodstock, New York. It, it's, it's hard running a, a website that's getting popular, and. You're, you're surrounded by people that are trying to, uh, you know, sway you into uh, doing all these other different things. Or, hey, why don't you include this feature? Or why don't you hook up with our company and give a link to us and we'll give a link to you? And it's, it's hard to kind of stick to your original mission and say, no, we're, we're a record store. You we don't sell CDs. <laughs> yeah, we don't want to get clogged. Yeah. And I, I don't want to <laughs> start selling advertising or 
forgetting what it's really all about in the first place. Well, that's, I'm going to check out your site. It's going to be cool. Yeah, CDbaby.com. Right. Okay. And yeah, if any, any musicians watching this show, if you guys have a CD out, just uh, go to CDbaby.com. It tells you how we can sell it for you. Fantastic. Excellent. Yeah. Okay, we want to welcome you back next time. Yeah. Thanks, man. Absolutely. I love it here. I'd be glad to come back. <laughs> All right, great. All right, I think we're going to do is going to take this out right now. We have coming up after this, we have How to Be with Courtney. She's becoming a model. So you got to stay tuned for this.